On Friday, November 9th, the Elihu Society brought Yale alumnus Richard Valeriani, class of 1953, back to Yale for a lecture in the Sterling Library for the public. A career spanning 31 years, Valeriani was the White House correspondent for the NBC News in the 1960s and 1970s. President of the Lahey Society, Grant Stegelman, spoke to the YDN about bringing Valeriani back to Yale and his personal insights from the speech. He was someone who can really attest to like what's currently happening in the media, where the nightly news is replaced now by a tweet. Um, be the consumer of the media who demands good reporting. It can't, it can't be wanting to hear about Snooki on the news, like that's going to only provide more Snooki on the news. Before his speech, okay. Valeriani so sat down with the news to elaborate so further on what he was planning to speak about and answer some questions we had. The mainstream media has lost the trust of a majority of Americans. One poll showed that 60% of Americans do not believe what they read in their newspapers, what they see on television, what they hear on the radio. That is three in five Americans. That's bad for the country. It's bad for democracy. Elihu Club member Scott Cannell, class of 1957, who was instrumental in bringing Valeriani to campus, also spoke with the news about why he thought Valeriani was an ideal choice to speak at Yale and what he took from his talk. He's inside. He's not getting the news in the newspaper or broadcast like we are. He's in there digging for it. He's asking questions in private with these people. He's watching them work with each other. He's, he, he can smell the truth. Regardless of how you consume the news, Valeriani made it clear that it is our responsibility to filter through the news and find reliable sources. Reporting from Yale Daily News, I'm Bruta Young.